With masts that rise over 100 feet above the water, the halyards are quite long, requiring very careful coiling to keep the lines organized so they will run free if needed and not become tangled. And you throw it out here in the rod away somewhere. Some are close, but you want to put it as close as possible to where the balloon pin is, where she stays fast. So you're just going to start your coil here. And now you're going to take this and you go between your legs and you're going to make yourself a modest three times. Well, just three times here and then it's the next and third. And now you're going to do something different. And this is so you can see what happens when you're trying. This thing goes fast and just gets caught on itself. Okay, I'm going to make three small intercoils where the edge of it goes just past the center. I'm keeping my eye on the center. I'm going to make this large enough so it just goes over the center. I'm going to go over here and make a second one, intersecting over it, overlapping it. And I'm being very careful, so I'm literally pushing this rope right down in position. I'm not trying to get up here and throw it over there, because then you're always going down there and mixing it and pulling it. So I'm, now I'm going to make a third one. See that? So I've just made three kind of smaller circles that overlap each other. Beautiful geometric symmetry. Now I'm going to make one large turn around, and I'm going to repeat it. Right on top, slow and deliberate, so it goes right on top of the other one. You can see it. You should be able to lay your small concentric circles, one right on top of each other, leaving yourself enough big, at least I have a fist that you can fit that through. Valentine guy was a genius. Made a beer, too. Did he? Oh, yeah. <laughs> used to be a bear. Same guy.